What's up guys? Welcome back to the channel. I have a couple of Olight torches and I've been promising for so long to do an absolute wrecking on them. I'm gonna beat the crap on them. I'm out here on the shooting range. This is our shooting range. We only mainly use like 22s around here. But I got a big gun with me. It's an absolute monster. You're gonna enjoy this one. I've got the bow. I've got a roll of duct tape. What is the worst that could happen? Now, I have a couple of O-Light torches and I wanna see how durable they really are. First up, we'll grab the torches, see how good they are. It's, it's daytime right now. I didn't wanna film at nighttime because you wouldn't have seen anything. I'm gonna grab the torches. I'm gonna to go through what I've got and then we'll, we'll get into it. Alrighty boys, in the lineup today, I've got all the torches that I can find. I have a few more, but who knows where they've gone. I've probably given them away. But we have the, we have the Warrior X Pro. That is the one that we ran over and stick probably through. And also on Skid Pig's channel, we threw it 12 meters in the ocean and it still works a treat. Still goes. This one, I carry this one every single day. This one's wicked, I use it for work. Battery lasts forever. Got a couple of little pen torches. So these are pretty bright for pen torch. Pen works great, nice and heavy. We have the Javelot Turbo. Now this one's a wicked hunting torch. I think this one goes up to about like 1300 meters or some shit. Fucking awesome. I have that on my gun in the safe. So this one stays with it. This is a pistol torch. I've used it a few times. It's also got a laser on it. So let me turn that on. It's got a laser on there. And then you can also flick it so it's a torch. And the laser is super accurate. Matty used this on my pistol at the range and he actually hit every single target. I think he got 40 out of 40. This one's a little headlamp. So nice and bright. It's good. You can click it on your pocket because it stands upright. You can use it. I'll use that like when I'm in roof space and shit like that. And then the Warrior X Turbo. This is a wicked little torch. I think this one does like 1100 meters and it's a wicked gun torch. Perfect for hunting. They all come, these, like these style ones, they all come with pouches and shit. So you can click it on your belt. Here's a little gun mount. This one's actually magnetic and it holds onto the barrel of your gun and it's absolutely wicked. I like that. So first up, first up we're gonna use this one. I'm gonna throw it at a few things, see how durable it is. See if it keeps turning on. This has been 12 meters deep in salt water. It still works. So I'm gonna continue trying to kill it today. Let's see how we go. Torch is on. Let's have a couple of chucks. Let it go. Ah! Oh shit. That nailed that lens. Beautiful. I reckon we can make it through that windscreen. Fucking yeet. Oh, nice. Nice. Is it on? It's still on. Awesome. That is cool. That's pretty. That's fucking good. What about the door of a car? Fucking yeet. We're gonna break the mirror off. We can break the mirror off. Let's break the mirror off. Let's break the fucking mirror. Let it go. Oh, there it is. I don't think I got the mirror. Oh, would you look at that? <laughs> Still on. Where did I hit? I think I hit there. Look at that. Dutz. Let's try to hit that mirror. Let's do it. Ready? Eight. Whoa, what a hit. What a fucking hit, boys. Still working. What else can we do? I want to do the windscreen again. Let's do that windscreen again. Windscreen is good. Oh, good hit. This is hurting my hand throwing this. Still on. Off, on, off, on. Whew. All right, that's, that's pretty impressive. That is pretty impressive. I've got another idea. I've got my compound bow. I've got a couple of arrows. This is probably gonna absolutely wreck my arrows. But I reckon we tape that to that. Ultimate weapon, ultimate. Now imagine seeing this light heading for you at a rate of knots. Whoo, that'd be wicked. All right, O lights on. I'm starting to think this is a bad idea. I'm a little bit scared. 
don't break and go through my hand. Oh, okay, it didn't break and go through my hand. We're safe, we're safe. Um, what do you reckon we go up? It doesn't feel like it's got a lot of power. I didn't want to use the big boat and then have the arrow just explode and then go through my hand. So I reckon we face you guys up. Here we go. Woo! Oh, right in the water. That absolutely landed straight in a puddle of water. Check that. Is it still on? Oh, it's still on. <laughs> I wonder how it go hitting a car. Ooh. Attempt two, just need to aim a bit higher. Whoops. I think it's a bit much for the little bow. I broke my knock. Knock, is that what they're called? Yeah, I'm pretty sure it's called that. All right. All right, knock is fixed. Let's see if we can't not dry fire it again. That'd be great. I hope everything's okay with this. It's scaring the crap out of me. Oh. Cop that. And it's still on. I was hoping it would die by now. I'm gonna try and hit it with the arrow. Maybe that'll work. So I'm gonna stick it on top of this. Right here. Right there. I'm gonna try and hit it with the arrow. I'm not that good of a shot. I'm not that good of a shot. Hit it. Oh! Yeah! Absolutely pile-drived my arrow. But where did it hit? Oh, I think it's hit. Check that hit out. That is a wicked hit. Can't get any better shot than that. Oh yeah. It only took me like five goes. Now, would you like to see the gun? Would you like to see it? All right, all right. You, you might want to sit down for this one. You might want to sit down. Sit down. All right, check this out. This is the ultimate, ultimate hunting weapon. Now, you heard of a 50 cal, right? Heard of a 50? This baby right here, this is an 85 cal. 85, you ask? Cody, never heard of it. Well, let me show you. Now, to give you guys a bit of a comparison of how big this round is, I have a 22. So this is a 22. It's huge. And the 85 cal, massive. Absolutely massive. Like, these are like 30 bucks each. Not, not cheap. Not cheap at all. I'm going to get a good spot. I'm going to prepare my shoulder, make sure I don't break it, and we're going to have a shot at the O-Light. I think she copped a bit of a flogging. Well, there you have it, folks. Olight can stand being an arrowhead, being thrown through a windscreen, being thrown up in the air, landing in water, but it doesn't like five shots from an 85 caliber rifle. All right, we're going to head back up, assess the damage, see how, see if we can get it going again. That's what I want to do. Got old man on his mini bike. Phew! boys this thing copped a bit of a beating I actually feel kind of bad for it so we got lead there proper lead penetration there straight into the battery that's where our arrow hit and then we also hit right here and then what surprised me is I hit it right on the what, what would you call these right on the heat break and it only put a dint like tiniest dint in it it's unreal. Well, that's the end of that torch. Love beer. See you next time.